VSOP Hip Hop and Wrestling, how you doing? This week's episode of Monday Night Raw took place from Seattle, Washington. We start this week's episode with Rey Mysterio in the ring. He talked about being part of the biggest WrestleMania ever and also being inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame, but it was bittersweet because his WrestleMania opponent was his own son, Dominic Mysterio, ex-con Dom. And clearly this feud is far from being over as Dominic interrupted Rey Mysterio's promo. He did his usual spill on how selfish Rey Mysterio is and how he only thinks about himself and said that he would have won their match at WrestleMania had it not been for that meddling bad bunny. So of course he came to the ring with some put together footage for us to reminisce on how bad bunny got choke slammed to oblivion through a table by Damian Priest. And Ray let Dominic know that he spoke to Bad Bunny and Bad Bunny is pissed. And he's going to piss all over you when he gets back. But in the meantime, how about me and you, Dom, have a rematch right here in Seattle? Which Dom said, ho, oh, I don't want to fight my own father. So out comes Finn Balor to accept the challenge. First match of the night, Finn Balor versus Rey Mysterio. This match was really good. You should go back and watch it. Ray sends Finn to the outside with a Frankensteiner. I love this next move. He slides under the bottom rope to do a splash to the outside. Fast forward, Dominic tries to interfere but fails. Ray hits the suicide dive and wipes everybody out on the floor. Dominic's second attempt to interfere actually works this time as he knocks Ray out with the chain. Finn hits the double foot stomp and gets the pin. Finn Balor has beaten Ray Mysterio. Backstage, somebody has attacked Lita and she is not able to compete in her tag team championship match tonight against Liv Morgan and Raquel Rodriguez. But luckily for Becky Lynch, Trish Stratus is in the building and she steps up to the plate to be Becky Lynch's tag team partner and defend the titles. So let's get to the match. Raquel Rodriguez and Liv Morgan against Trish Stratus and Becky Lynch. I thought the match itself was pretty good, especially as we got towards the end of it where the action picked up. Lots of high-risk maneuvers, drop kicks, Frankensteiners, leg drops, and this Tower of Doom spot right here on Liv Morgan. Ugh. Becky gets Liv in the disarmor, but no submission. Liv hits the code breaker, what a maneuver. Stratus misses the kick and gets rolled up for a pin, and they lose the championship gold. Becky's still a good sport, says no worries, it's all good. But then Trish turns on Becky Lynch. Not sure why, especially after that long physical match, but I assume she has her reasons and we're gonna find out soon enough because when Byron asked her backstage, she had nothing to say. The almighty Bobby Lashley and Bronson Reed bringing the tsunami to Seattle. What's getting ready to go down, Big E? Big meaty man slapping me. <laughs> Two big mean guys going at it. Hard hitting clotheslines. Giant shoulder blocks off the apron. Bumping meat. Say it again, Biggie. Big man with big chest. Bumping meat. The Almighty hits a snap suplex and a failed attempt at the hurt lock. Bronson Reed, what a maneuver. Check out this spine buster. Lashley gets the hurt lock in finally, but the action spills to the outside. These men continue to brawl on the floor to the point where they get counted out by the referee. One of the few times where I'll accept a count out for a finish because I want some more of this action. Ain't that right, Biggie? Ah. The American Nightmare makes his way to the ring for a promo. All smiles, double pyro, as if he didn't get his ass whooped last week, but he's taking it seriously. Look at this death stare. These are the eyes of a psycho like no other mother. And he challenges Brock Lesnar to a match at Backlash. The Usos make their way to the ring to take on the Alpha Academy. Both teams looking to get back in the rankings for the tag titles. Most of the matches were good this evening, and this is no exception. The Usos coming off the top rope with the double team water maneuver. Chad Gable with the exploder suplex. Otis gets in the ring and starts hitting power slam after power slam. What a maneuver. Chad Gable hits the bulldog off the top rope, but does not get the three count. The Usos hit a super kick, and then the 1D for the one, two, three. Usos victorious. Eo Sky, Mia Yim, and Piper Nevin competing for a shot at Bianca Belair's championship. Eo Sky hits a beautiful moonsault to the outside. Top rope Frankensteiner on Mia Yim and a springboard drop kick on Piper. Mia Yim gets some offense with the Dragon Suplex, a code red, and then a eat defeat. But Eo Sky steals the victory with a moonsault, and she is the number one contender. Bianca Belair, watch out. 
Backstage, Kevin Owens, knowing he has a bad leg, is getting ready to face this maniac right here, Solo Sokoa, ready for war. Here comes one half of our tag team champions. Sami Zayn is not in the building yet due to flight delays, but the fight must go down. Solo goes to work on Kevin Owens' leg for most of the match, but Kevin does his best to fight back and get some offense. But that leg is getting the best of him. Kevin Owens tries to go for the cannonball, but can't. Solo gets Kevin Owens on the top rope, but Kevin pushes him off and hits a frog splash, followed by a swanton bomb and a pop-up power bomb. But Jey Uso interferes, and that's all she wrote. Thumb to the throat. One, two, three. Solo Sokoa has beaten Kevin Owens, and the beatdown continues post-match. But here comes Sami Zayn and Matt Riddle to the rescue. Better late than never, they take the fight to the Usos on the outside and Solo Sokoa on the inside and sends him out the ring. Kevin Owens hits the stunner on Jimmy Uso. The bloodline won the battle tonight, but the war continues, and now Matt Riddle is an ally to Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, so this feud must continue. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you sticking around. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. The SOP out.